Muslin by Benjamin Moore. That is my color review for today. As always, I'm going to reveal the undertone of this beige, as well as color comparisons that you can see so you can truly identify the color and the undertone yourself, and the best whites to pair for your trim and ceilings, and some lovely color palettes that you can use with muslin. So stick with me. I'm Claire Jefford. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, hit the bell below, and you'll be notified every time I publish a new video. But first, I want to make sure that you have done my color quiz so you know which palette best reflects your style. So look in the description below, take the quiz and find out if you're coastal, moody, jewel toned or organic. All right, so you know it's when we compare color, if you've been following me here on my channel for any sort of time, that's when we can see the undertone more clearly and identify it more easily. And so take a look here. All of these three colors are pink beiges. All right, but the natural linen on the far end actually looks a little more green when you compare it with muslin in the middle. And then here we have brandy cream, which is closest to me, and that really is more pink than the muslin. And just so you know, yes, beige is back. Looking at the best whites to pair for your trim, your ceiling or kitchen cabinetry, we have here cloud white, which is a little more creamy, looks lovely with muslin. I have two more here for you as well. White Dove, I've done a video review on White Dove. If you haven't seen it, make sure you go check it out. But it also looks lovely with muslin. Again, it's a softer tone, not so bright, so it works well. And the brightest of the whites here is Simply White OC117 by Benjamin Moore. So if you have elements that are a little more crisp, then you might want to look at this color here for your trim and ceiling. I'm gonna show you all three of them together so you can see the differences between the whites. Now you can see here how the whites, they aren't all the same. All whites are not created equal. So I've got cloud white on the end, white dove, which is a little less creamy than the cloud white, and then the brightest of the whites, simply white, which will all work beautifully with muslin. I'm gonna show you some color palettes that you could put together with muslin, but first I wanna make sure that you know about my essential color guides. These are digital downloads. I have printed all of mine off, but I have one for many and most of the colors that I review here of Benjamin Moore and Farrell and Ball and a couple Sherwin-Williams as well. So if you want more inspiration and everything to hand, make sure you look in the comments below. And I have them for pretty much all the colors that I review here on my YouTube channel. So go check it out. As promised, here is a lovely palette that you could use with muslin. So at the far end, I have Wickham Gray by Benjamin Moore. That is a blue-green gray, which I've also done a color review on. And I've got Van Dusen Blue, HC156, which is one of my favorite blues in addition to Benjamin Moore's Hail Navy. We've also got Ranch Wood, which is a great taupe color, brings in a little bit of contrast when you put it up against muslin. Now take a look at this where I've put it together with a couple of different fabrics. Often I find inspiration from fabrics or area rugs as a jumping off point for an entire room design. And here is no different. So you could see I pulled this, this is a dural leaf fabric, and you can see how beautifully it works with this palette here. So you don't have to paint your room all of these colors, but you can incorporate them in different ways into your decorative elements. And this fabric here, a little more playful and fun with a leopard print, but with blues and taupes. So you can see how beautifully it would work in this sort of a backdrop. Imagine a dark navy sofa, your walls are painted muslin, and then you have accents of ranch wood and Wickham gray color tones. Just beautiful. I wanna hear from you. Have you used muslin by Benjamin Moore? Comment below, I'd love to hear your thoughts. And make sure that you are subscribed to my channel here for more color clarity. I'll see you next time. Cheers.